Peggy 3. Hey, what's up guys and gals, Rick9G here, thank you for joining me. If you don't know me, I do a lot of indie gaming videos, specifically focus on indie games of course, and here we're going to look at Farming Simulator 17. Now of course Farming Simulator 17 is a big hit, big game that's going to come out October 25th. And we're going to look at gameplay number 2, Tending to Animals trailer. Now what Giants is doing here, they're trying to focus on the animals and the animals that we're going to get, which are of course chickens, which came before, sheep, which came before, and cows. The new animal are basically the pigs. We are getting pigs in the game and this trailer is primarily focused on the pigs. We do see a little bit of the cows. We don't see too much changes there. Uh, we don't see pretty much any changes for the sheep and the chicken are shown in passing. So let's take a look. I'm gonna kind of break down the important parts of the trailer for you. If you wanna look at the full entire trailer, go ahead and look at the description. I'm gonna have a link to it. I just wanna focus on the primary interesting tidbits that's shown in the trailer and highlight some things which might be really interesting to you. So without further ado, let's take a look. Now here we have a quick opening shot painting right to the chickens. Now of course this is deliberate to show us that chickens will be in the game. But again, no changes are really made, nothing new. It shows us in the pen with the chickens. So it's trying to show us that hey, you're going to be in the pen with the chickens collecting. Nothing pretty much new. But then the trailer continues immediately and goes right into the tractor and the actual trailer in the back that holds the new pigs. Now according to what we know so far, this is the smallest animal trailer in the game that you can get, at least that's what's been revealed, and you can put nine pigs in here. Now we're not really told any information about the cows, we never see cows at least in this trailer inside, so we don't know if they could be transported or if it's just exclusive pigs. I'm going to guess cows can go in here, but obviously less of them. I do want to call attention to this photo right here and it's a really quick pan. It's Emerson's Livestock Market and this is where the tractor and the animal trailer stops first to get the animals. This is basically your store to purchase your animals. And so you come over here, there's a little bit of a UI that shows up later that shows you how to buy them and gives you price and so forth. But I think it's really cool that you have to go to this location. And so look at this, what we have here, a Massey Ferguson 7726 with the Joskin Bed and Max RDS 7500 and it says here capacity 9 pigs. Now you see it's kind of cryptic because you know 100% pigs go in here. Could cows go in here? Maybe, possibly, but it doesn't say 9 pigs, 3 cows or you know 9 pigs, 2 cows and so forth. And so we don't know if this is exclusive or not. Um, there is a larger one and that holds 21 pigs. Now we're going to be able to look at it in a little bit, but I'm guessing that we'll be able to transport the cows as well. Either way, it's really cool to see the Massey Ferguson 7726 and the Joskin trailer right in the back. They're both new. They both have never been in Farming Simulator and it's really, really fun to see them included in the game. And here for the first time, we can see the pigs inside the Joskin trailer. We can see three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine in there. And that's really cool. I'm sure if you have two, they'll be distributed in a different way or maybe not, but I think they look really good in there. Now the trailer continues as the tractor and the animal trailer behind it is bringing all the pigs to your location in your farm. Now what's really interesting is we drive by the sheep, which is really funny, and they're just kind of grazing there, not anything interesting coming from the sheep department but what's really cool is that the tractor actually backs up the pigs into the unloading area and I'm gonna play this little clip for you it actually shows you how they disappear and go into your area the trailer continues by showing two other new pieces of equipment a new tractor and basically this is a water hauler or this is a trailer that holds water and that is used for your pigs the New Holland T5 120 and the Joskin Aquatrans XL 7300S and the capacity 7300 liters. Now this is really interesting because remember in this game now you will have to actually add water to your pigs for them to be able to produce other pigs because that's a mechanic here. Um, they multiply and they create more pigs for you to sell. Now this is the pig trough especially for the water. 
that is used for the pigs to drink. And so here's the Joskin and the New Holland, and it is dumping the water that you collected. You pick up from a water fountain or water source, and basically you dump it for the at this point in the trailer, it completely changes gears and we move on to baling. And now a big thing that people wanted was to actually strap the bales down. And here we're introduced to two things, the Valtra T234 tractor with the Flegel DWP 180 trailer to hold the bales. Now what's really cool is they actually show us the strapping down mechanic. It works for round bales and square bales the same and at different configurations it looks like it's really flexible to what you want to do which is really great you could do three bales you could do two bales it seems like it's a very intuitive thing to use and very simple as well now the trailer continues from strapping down the bales to focus on the cows so this is a look at how we feed the cows now and if you're not familiar with 15 you know that hay straw and silage are used to feed your cows. And this is really interesting because two new pieces of equipment are introduced to us, the Silo King Self-Line Compact 1612 and the JCB 260 Skid Steer Loader. Wow, that was a mouthful. But yes, we have the Silo King here, which is very similar to the ration mixer we already had in 15, but I'm sure there are little tweaks they're gonna do. And the skid steer loader is pretty much completely new, at least in the vanilla game. There was a mod that used something very similar to this, but this is great because this is gonna help us to load and unload our bales in a much more efficient way than with the telehandler. Giants shows us that the skid steer loader can grab square bales as well as round bales and basically the system is pretty similar to using the telehandler and the bale spike as you can see that going into the mixer here you see the round bales and it's pretty similar nothing new nothing shocking but at least it's a little bit of an introduction to what we're going to be and here we have the Kuhn Primor 15070M feeder and straw blower. Now why is this important? Well you see the feeder on the top, the open space is a lot larger than in Farming Simulator 15 and that's super helpful to put the square bales and the round bales in there. And of course it blows the straw everywhere into the pen of the animal. So this is going to be great bedding for them. And of course here we are, here it is, the MAN TGS 18.1. 480 with the Mikileto AM19 capacity 21 pigs. Again, I don't know if cows will be able to be transported in this. I'm guessing yes. I'm guessing yes for sheep. But this is just giving you an idea of how big this monstrous trailer is. Imagine 21 pigs in here, all the little holes for ventilation, which is really cool. So when you start to buy more and more pigs, you can also use this trailer, which is a great advantage. Now I want to show you the UEI on this, and let's look at a few things. Now this is the simple UI that was made. It is titled the Animal Dealer, and if you can see on the top left, you of course have your little piggy. It says 3,000 per pig. Your farm has 16 pigs already on the bottom there. In the middle it says unload, or it also says load, and you can do that as well. And so this is how you work it out. If you note, down at the bottom it says if you do not transport the animals with your own transport trailer they can charge you a fee and that can happen on your own so it's really cool you can decide how many or how few go in the trailer and manage that yourself and that is pretty much it guys and gals thank you so much look at the trailer there going by this is how the actual game trailer finishes farming simulator 17 available october 25th let me know down below farmers and non-farmers alike virtual and real life farmers let me know what you think let me know what you think of the concept of the pigs and the feeding the pigs and the water and all the visuals of what is going on i think we're in for a great surprise in this game i'm super excited all of these exciting things coming if you're new to the to the channel welcome thank you so much for joining me my name is rick 9g i highly focus on farming simulator it's one of my favorite games so you can see i have lots of videos and lots of things to look at so don't forget to browse the channel before you leave hit subscribe if you like this to see all of the farming simulator 17 news that is upcoming i will stay right with it and don't forget guys and gals always stay positive always better yourself and most importantly be hopeful